Welcome back to a Don't Starve uh, Reign of Giants uh, Spring Guide. Let's get some music playing here. Don't really have a point to holding on to this pretty parasol as my sanity is just about at its maximum. Approximately, of course. It's rounded up, I guess. But it is at 200, and there you go, it's not coming up anymore. So I have no point in using it, holding on to it, as it is not raining right now. Uh, okay, so I can chop down one more big tree, and I have 20% of an axe left remaining. Which I want to keep, and I want to hold on to. Uh, first of all, because chopping down medium-sized birch trees will not give, uh, nuts, or, you know, uh, birch nuts, yeah. Um, with pine trees, you can chop medium-sized trees and they'll give just one. So that's something, but um, birch trees, that's not the case. It's its its balanced that way. Uh-oh. Ah, there you see. Red bee is attacking me. That's how bees are in the spring. Oh, dear. But as long as you avoid enemies, then you should be fine. Won't take damage unless you get hit or you are, your things are low. The, I think like the only things that hurt you are monsters, uh, starving, like you know zero, uh, like completely hungry, and zero, uh, stomach meter, and um. And weather effects like uh, you know being too cold or being too hot. But with weather effects, you'll get a notification like you know ice, as you saw last day, I think yesterday, ice was covering the screen, and with the heat of summer, um, I guess like flames sort of will cover the screen, or I guess like. I guess steam would? Yeah, I think so. Indicating that it is really hot out. Oh, another savanna. Unlike the other one, this one actually has rabbit holes. Rabbits are most common in normal savannas like this one, unlike the one right over here. You know, by that uh, forest. I wonder, let's see if this is... Okay, so frames aren't dropping in this video, so... Yeah, this should be going pretty good. Looking good. I did a little test, but not much. I guess I'll chop down this one. This, uh, rock. Now, as you, you can see, the uh, that kind of boulder drops niter. I guess I could use the Snyder later on, so um, I guess I'll actually wear this. Yeah, now I can hold on to this stuff. Snyder is used for um, endothermic fires, but that's a scientific thing. That's something I can't really do just yet. Let me see if I can find another rock. There should be another. In the um, in the savanna, so I'm gonna head back out there, or maybe there could be rocks out here. This is an interesting kind of biome. Let me go on this road, walking a little quicker than usual. Well, here's a graveyard. Graveyards may have some gold in them, and I'll pick that up later. Okay, just as I expected, sort of. Uh, there's this. This is actually a really good place to uh, get inventing. I'm not sure. Let me see here. Alright, so here's the science machine. Oh, there's a dead guy. Dropped a lot of stuff there. Um, <clears throat> so I can build a basic farm with the science going on. As you can see, I have to have a science machine. But not an improved farm. Improved farms, I believe, grow crops uh, 50 like twice as fast, I think. So they're much better. But they do need rocks, which aren't really common 
So here's this endothermic, endothermic fire. Not going to use it. It basically cools you off instead of warming you up. Um, Alright, I want to check something. I'm not sure if I can make... No, okay, this Ice fling matic is important for the uh, summer because when thing because things will actually burn in the summer and that's very bad I will actually not pick up this stuff you know just to be fair you might not find that kind of thing that boon I think it's called oh it's night I guess I'll show you what happens at night you lose a lot of sandy and if you stay out too long Oh. As you heard, something was coming after me. That was, um, I think people call him Charlie, or her Charlie. It is, um, very dangerous. It will hurt you for a hundred damage. So, pickaxe, I got like six and a half of these rocks. And I'm going to get like six or seven and a half more. Oh, uh, in the corner of the, of, you know, where this fire reaches. So, losing that sandy quite quickly, but I'm fine. I can handle it. Because, well, first of all, let me cook these just because. And pre-build this. And let's start inventing, shall we? Inventing will increase your sanity by 15. Very nice. There you go. Much better. And let's keep making stuff. I need four boards, as you saw here. And I need a couple more cut stone because I need to make electrical doodads. I have them here, and I have no more gold. Okay, <laughs> I had just enough gold. And now I can pre build an alchemy engine. So I'm actually going to gather the ice that uh, is in these uh, glaciers because I'm going to hold on to it for later. Because I need to make that ice flingomatic. Because things will burn down in the summer. So stay tuned for that. Goodbye.